So I, I just got done cleaning my room. Um, I feel great today. I don't know why, but I just do. I feel amazing. I feel positive. I got my favorite color tie that kitty shirt. Um, if you wonder where I got this from, um, Walmart connection. You know, if you want this shirt, they should have it in Walmart still. But I am going to cook today. And I'm gonna try my best. Well, I'm not gonna try my best. I'm gonna try. Cause it's been such like a long time since I cooked. Yeah, I'm gonna try to cook, guys. So you guys could watch that. Uh, it's gonna be in this vlog. And I am doing a story time. So it should be up before this vlog. So stay tuned. I feel like crap today. But I also feel positive and I feel good. I just feel really tired. I don't know why. Maybe because I got up early. I usually be falling asleep like 3 in the morning. I don't know why. Just lately. I've been falling asleep really late. But. Other than that. Oh. 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 So I am going to make coffee. I'm going to show you guys. See? This is how I make my coffee. I put it in. Boom. See? Fill it up. Okay. Then, I put it in the microwave for one minute and ten seconds. Yo, why is it every time that I vlog, there's always a cop car? Like, what is what, what's good with what's good with that? You see? See? Watch. Next time I do when I vlog, there's gonna be a cop. Every time in my videos, every time I have the camera on, there's a cop passing by. I don't know why. I'm telling you, you hear cops all the time out in New York City. Like you could walk down the block late at night at four in the morning. You hear cops going, woo, 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 like, for real. Then, you get the coffee creamer, right? You get a regular spoon. Don't get so much, this much. Put it in, then get some sugar. Not a lot. And boom, and stir. This is how I drink my coffee because, um, I don't really like a lot of milk. I like the natural coffee taste, so. This is how you make coffee. Simple and easy if you don't want too much um, calories in your coffee. Like one spoon of sugar is not gonna hurt, but use this. This is way better. The powder creamer is much better, you guys, trust me. So this is what I'm making, chicken cutlet, and I'm gonna add a uh, sausage and the rice and chicken cutlet bake. But I'm gonna make them crispy. Oh, I'm gonna make them so crispy, you guys. It's not even funny. I'm gonna hook it up, watch. Just watch. So when it's time for cook, get your coffee, get your water, get whatever you drinking, cause y'all about to watch some good cooking. Bye. So you guys, I'm about to go tell my mom that I'm cooking. And you're gonna hear, wait, what? Are you okay? Are you feeling all right? Just watch. watch. Ma, I have a big surprise for you. Yeah. I'm cooking dinner today. Yeah. Okay. All right. Cooking dinner. What? What? How? Oh man, I wanted to surprise them. And you see, it's already late. You see, it's already late. You see, the viewers already know. It's okay. It's okay. I don't know what you're gonna cook. Okay. Alright. Alright. Oh my goodness. I guess she knew. How, wait, how she knew I was gonna cook? Oh, she probably was saying I was gonna cook dinner. 
Mm, okay, mom. I see how. Okay, using a using the ice cream to cook dinner, right? For you today, and then you'd have been like, okay, make this. I'd have been like, okay. Oh, but I'm making my own special recipe. Okay, you see, too much think of like, you see, me and my mom think a lot, uh, like a lot for some reason. It's weird. Like me and my mom are like best friends. No lie. Like that's my number one. Like I love her a whole lot. So I'm gonna cook for her because you know she um she's not feeling good. So I'm gonna cook for her and I'm gonna show you guys. So stay tuned for the cooking show and it's not just a cooking show because you know why guess what because we're gonna remix it you know what's in the call nando's tv cooking show coming your way soon so remember how i was gonna tell you guys i'm gonna show you what i'm cooking and show you how to cook it well basically you get chicken cutlet which i already started cutting one just to show you ex just to show example well basically they come so fat as you can tell so you're gonna like cut it you're gonna get a sharp knife and you're gonna like cut it into like thin pieces and as you cut in it lift it up so you can know exactly how you're cutting it and I'm gonna show you and as you cut it And hold on. This one is like really thin at the bottom. So. So basically, you're gonna cut it like this. You see? Then I got egg. And I got some, uh, what do you call that? Seasoning. Some seasoning, which you could fry with. So, which is, I'm gonna do this. And then after I'm done doing this, I'm gonna show you what else you gotta do. So after you cut the chicken, you're gonna season it with some adobo, garlic, Yo, to, um, the bus up. and parsley, parsley flakes. Yeah. Our parsley flakes supposed to be, it's supposed to um, make the food taste better, so I'm gonna mix it. I really don't like mixing chicken with my hands, but it's clean, so. Okay. So I'm gonna wash my hands. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna grab one. Come here. I put it in flour. Right? Then I put it in the egg. I use four eggs. Okay. Then you put it on here. And you then you season it. Then you throw the seasoning. Basically the powder, the the uh, flour is to keep it together so it won't break when it's baking. Then show them. I added some olive oil. This right here. I added some of this. Okay. So what, okay. you're gonna, what you're gonna do is you're gonna get a regular hand towel and you're gonna spread it. spread it with the hand towel. This is a healthy way so you guys won't have to use regular oil in the pool. Just use some of this, mix it around. Make sure you got the pan all like greased up with it. And moisture. <laughs> and moisture. And then. You get the chicken cutlet and you place it. So after you do that for all of them, I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna turn the oven on to 350 and leave it for like an hour. And I'll show you guys when it's done. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna cut three of these for the rice and I'm gonna show you how I do it. So I added the seasoning and the uh, sausages, I'm gonna let it cook for a little. And I put some garlic, and I put some of my mom's secret recipe that she made. 
and I'm gonna throw the rice and then when it's cooked when it's like almost cooked I'll show you guys secret is uh, if the spoon could stand up like this as you can see that means you put a good amount of rice and it's gonna cook good and it's gonna um, bake well um, cook well so I put the the beans in and the rice I'm gonna let it cook and then when everything is done I'll show you guys Ooh, so dinner is done um it is six o'clock I just finished but look you guys I made this all by myself I'm gonna show you you remember I tell you how the the flour makes a stick definitely made a stick look look at that hold on let me see if I could get a perfect view on it hold on right there you see I'm gonna take a bite see mmm it's cooked and everything and the rice with the sausage right here mmm bomb and I wanted to show you guys you could still eat regular smaller portion of rice you see I put my rice in a cup and like a small little baby bowl and I put it on the plate and the rest is chicken yo this is so good I would never thought I could cook I have the headphones in because I was editing my story time video which I'm about to put up. Mmm. It's so crunchy. Mmm. Honestly, it's been a good minute since I like cooked anything. Let's be honest, because my mom is the one that's always cooking, and, you know, for everyone. So, like, today, I'm going to just cook for everyone, and I cook for everyone. And this is really good. I'm not gonna lie, like before, I used to be a horrible cook. I cooked, um, I used the way when I cooked rice, it will be like so sticky and like together. And the reason is because I used to throw a little bit of water and rice, and it will make it stick. So it was kind of like sticky rice, and it wasn't, it was not good. Everybody laughed at me. And then, after a while, as I saw my mom cook in the kitchen, sit there and talk to her, I learned. And I finally got it. Hmm. This stuff is so good. What you guys are having for dinner today? Later on tonight, wherever you are, what's for dinner? Leave it down in the comment. Oh, and also, if you guys like mukbang for me, just tell me in the comment that you like and you'd like to see more, and I'll do more. So,
Well, I didn't think plan for this week. This weekend I'm going to the gym. And hopefully do a challenge that I always wanted to do. So. Let's see if I can do that challenge. Because it's pretty hard. But. Hopefully I get to. Yo. This is bomb. Like I never thought. Like. I'm not saying I'm the best cook, but yo, this came out so good. So good. Here, take a bite. Here, take a bite. Ah, uh, here, take a bite. Mmm. Right, it tastes good? I know it tastes bomb. Mm mm mm. I'm drinking apple juice. I like been drinking water. And I'm like, oh, I want something like flavor. So I got apple juice. But, <clears throat> oh, I'm getting full. I hope you guys enjoy. I can't eat no more. And look. I still have this. Oh, I'm full. But, other than that, I'm gonna end the vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed that little cooking, that little cooking scene in this vlog. Um, if you wanna know how I did it, just comment down below and I'll tell you. But, um, other than that, thank you for watching this vlog um, video. Hope you like it. Give the video a thumbs up. And if you're a new subscriber to my channel, subscribe. And if you want to know when I post videos, press the bell to be notified. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.